video review for Transformers Hunt for the Decepticons Voyager Class Highbrow. So here's Highbrow. I've had him for a little bit now. Uh, very cool figure. Like I said, uh, Voyager Class. Um, not too big in uh, plane mode. He is a World War II style plane, I believe. And a very nice plane at that. A cool feature that he does have in vehicle mode is that if you press the engines here, it, it spins the, the rotate. It rotates these. But since one of these doesn't uh, snap into place, that would be this one. Since it doesn't snap into place, occasionally it'll come out of line. Uh, it was one of them, I forget. But it's not doing it now, of course, since I'm in the middle of view. Uh, you can have these pieces folded down to kind of give them like upside down you know, wing pieces, but then the bottom landing gear does not touch. So this is how I, this is how I keep it in view of mode. <coughs> Excuse me, uh, I've been a little sick recently. So uh, to transform him, what you want to do is first things first, you want to pop off his missile launchers there, which will be in his hand late, which will be in his hands later. Uh, then you want to just obviously fold down on the landing gear. What you do is pull up the camera a little bit. And you want to uh, snap those out. Then you want to unpeg everything. And unpeg these, the cockpit, the pieces surrounding the cockpit there. They do snap out of place. They're just in there very, just snug. <laughs> Sorry, this pieces just are not wanting to come out. There we go. They were just in there very nice and tight. Gonna refocus. There we go. There we go. Uh, just want to snap them out like that and you know, have everything out like this. Temper I actually want to have everything out like that temporarily. Then you want to fold down the legs. Do the same thing with this piece. Uh, peg that. And fold it down. And the waist snaps in there. Then you want to take these pieces. Um, actually, you want to f fold that around. Then you want to fold that down and fold those two pieces up and um, wait, I forget exactly how you do this just actually want to get these and fold those down and those become the back pieces to the feet like that legs, I, I mean the feet I've always had, I've had a little bit of trouble with, so sorry if they do not turn out correct. I've just had a little bit of trouble with them. Then you just want to fold down the artillery pieces there. I'll, I'll actually, I'm actually going to go to the feet last. Then you want to fold those pieces down, like that. <clears throat> then the hands fold out. You want to fold the blades together. <coughs> And uh, messed with these pieces back here. Then once you get the, once I can get the feet correct, um, he'll be finished. I forget. Sorry, I'm like I said, I'm having a lot of trouble with the feet recently. Alright, well, like I just, I'm just gonna let it go like this. Uh, for the time being. Just gonna let it go for the time being. 
<laughs> like not how it is. Um, and I'll fix it later because it's being a little bit of a pain right now. Uh, so there you have Highbrow. And Highbrow is a very, very nice figure. Uh, pretty cool. Uh, you know, not the best out there uh, by, all, by any means. Not the best figure out there like uh, by any means, but Highbrow is definitely one of the top, top-notch uh, figures in this line, I think. And he deserves, you know, to obviously be recognized and actually show up in his stores for some people. Because of what I have noticed is that Highbrow, his wave has some of the worst distribution right now. And that nobody's really finding him. There we go. I finally got the feet to cooperate with me. There. Um, that his wave, him in the blue fall, him in the blue, give me your face fallen that I've already reviewed. They have some of the worst distribution out there right now. So, sorry if you guys have not been able to find him. I got the last one of Hasbro Toy Shop at the time. I do not know if they're if he's back in stock yet. Which you know I don't really care anymore. Uh, so. Highbrow, like I said, is a very nice figure. People have complained about like where the hands are, just being right at the side of the, the rudder pieces, which I actually do not see a problem with it. It still adds, a, it doesn't take away or add anything to the figure, but still, a very, very nice figure. I wouldn't knock it off just because of the hands. Um, he does still have a, a, lit, a battle mask. He has a battle mask there that you can see. It's just kind of like an old-fashioned, if it's going to want to zoom in. Just like an old-fashioned, uh, air, you know, uh, mask that, that, you know, air, airline pilots put on, you know, during, that you would see in, like, old videos and stuff. Like, on cartoons and stuff, too, so. I thought that pretty cool. Because that was something they didn't have to do. So. Uh, articulation-wise, very good articulation. Can rotate a full 360. Uh, can go forward and back at the elbow. Can rotate at the upper bicep. And then the rudder pieces can move. The head can rotate a full 360 degrees. No waist articulation, but the legs can go forward and back. Have the ability to go side to side, but the but uh, the only way they can is if you lift up the the side missile port area, the side missile area. Then it's a very tight joint on mine. They can bend at the knee, and the feet can have a lot of posability in them too. Uh, so, like I said, this is the proper fix it pro proper uh, thing for the feet because mine normally just one of the joints in here is really tight and it was not cooperating when I was starting the when I first transformed him so I, I got it too so like I said very very nice figure if you guys can find him or find you know get him for a cheap price or you know retail price or on a website do it don't hesitate very very nice figure um, you know reminds me a lot of the G1 highbrow so <clears throat> go out and get him transformers hunt for the decepticons highbrow and yes i noticed my back screen area was is messing up it wasn't sturdy for a long time so <laughs> sorry but there you guys have it transformers hunt for the decepticons voyager class highbrow